Hello viewers, how are you doing out here? I hope you are doing great. My name is Rafi Yaku from Exec Graphics and Multimedia. In today's video, I'm going to teach you how you can make a professional certificate in Corel Draw. If you are watching my video for the first time on YouTube, please click the subscribe button for more interesting video in Corel Draw. So let's get the tutorial started. Welcome back, friend. So the first thing you have to do is to make a big size of 8.2 by 5.8. Then make sure you set your page orientation to the landscape. Then everything should be in inches. Once you are done, then you are good to go with the design. So let's start the tutorial in full. I'm going to drag this for one side here. Okay. So next, I'll go to my toolbar and double click the rectangle to make a page for there. Then I'll come to edge of the rectangle here, drag it down. Then I'll place with my right click just to make a page for there. Okay. Then I'll go to my toolbar again and select my pen tools here. Then I'll make a path from this point here. Now make another part here. Good. Then I'll come down below here and make another part. Then I'll make another part here. Then I'll select everything now and click on group. Now select this. I'll press and shift on my keyboard and click on group here. Next, I will duplicate this shape by press Ctrl Z on my keyboard, then Ctrl V on my keyboard. Then I'll go to my menu bar here. I will choose middle vertical, middle horizontal, and then middle vertical. Next, so I'll press down shift key on my keyboard and select the page border. Then I'll press T on my keyboard, then R on my keyboard. Next, I have to come down below here and select my smart view. Now I can fill every area. Right, so I'll copy this with red. I'll color this with red. Good. Then I can select everything. I only come to this side here to remove the stroke. Good. Then I can start in document. Now I can. Select this 
I press shift key on my keyboard, select this, and select this, and select this, and I click on wedge. Now I've select this, I'll select this, I'll select this, and I'll click on wedge. And I'll color this with black. Sorry. I have to select everything and remove stroke. Okay. And I'll select this, press shift key and select this, and I'll fill this with red, okay? Then I'll select this and select this. And I'll choose red, and I'll color it with black. Good. I'll select this. And I'll color it with black. Good. Then now I will select this. And I'll select this. And click on wedge. I'll select this. And this. And this. And I'll click on wedge. Z. Wedge. Then I will apply my fonting. Then copy color fill. Let to copy this color here. Good. I'm going to copy this also. My fountain fill, then copy color fill. Good. Good. Now it's to remain this side. So my fonting fill, copy color fill. Good. My fonting fill, and copy color fill. Good. to zoom out the entire document I'm going to click on wedge my font in fill copy color fill boom so I'm going to zoom in the entire document again Next one is this. So my fountain fill. Then I'm going to remove piece of copy color fill. And I'm copy this. Same thing here. This. Now, next thing I'm going to do just to make use of all the text here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to Ungroup this and I'll copy this all these text here. 
So I'm going to delete this. this I'm going to place it here I'm going to zoom out the entire document then I'll adjust Adjust this. I will press P to make sure it's center. And I'll drag it to the top here. Now I adjust this part here. And this here. I need to take them back. Finally, we have our Creative Professional Certificate in Corel. If you enjoyed this video, please click like button. And also, don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more interesting video in Corel. Thank you for watching the video from the beginning to the end. See you soon. Bye.